hello welcome back to my channel today i'm sharing how i made zobo fruit and vegetable punch in the bowl i have half cup of zobo leaves that have been well cleaned and in the cup i have hot water so what i do is pour the hot water into the bowl and then set the bowl aside for 30 minutes to one hour before i sieve it Next, I'm showing you the vegetable and the fruits I use. I use the medium sized cucumber. I'm going to cut it in half. I'm going to blend half of it, and the other half I'm going to cut in small bits to use as filling for the zobo. I have two apples here. I'm going to blend one apple, and then the other apple I'm going to cut in small bits. I have three oranges. I'm going to blend two oranges, including the flesh, and then the third orange I'm going to cut in small bits and put into the zobo as part of the filling for the zobo. So I've already divided the cucumber into two and then the parts that I'm going to use for the filling, I'm just cutting it into smaller sizes. After cutting it in circles, I divide the circle into half. So this is basically the size that I was fine with. If you would like yours to remain circular, you can definitely leave them in that shape. Next, I'm chopping up the apples. So I'll divide the apple usually into four and then de-seed it. I always make sure I wash the apples, the vegetable, and even the orange because I'm going to add it directly into the zobo. So I want to make sure that the back of all of them is well clean. So now after the zobo had stood for about 30 minutes to an hour, I sieved it. I used um, this sieve I have on hand. If you don't have this type of sieve, you can always use a sieve cloth that works well. And then after sieving this in, the next thing I'm going to do is sieve in the cucumber and fruit blend. So I'm just sieving that in now. I blended the cucumber, the apple, and the orange with about a cup of water. And then I'm sieving that directly into the zobo. So yeah, adding as much or as little water as your blender needs and depending on the consistency of the zobo that you want. So yeah, that's basically it. It's ready now and I'm just adding in the filling. I've added some already. And I thought I'll turn my camera on so I can show you as I add the other ones. So I'm adding in the cucumber, the apple, and the orange. So after doing that, I stir it and stir it so that it can mix well with the zobo. And after stirring it, if you want it to really infuse, you have to set it aside for some time. So I'm setting it aside. I'm going to leave it for about three hours so that the fruits and the vegetable can really infuse into the zobo before I enjoy it. I thought I'll take some pictures so that you can really appreciate how beautiful this looks. This is a drink that is easy to make. You can make it while you have guests around or before you have them come so that it can really infuse before they come. And then you can serve it to them. Of course, it's something you can serve for just yourself and your family too. It works as well for just the people at home and for when you have guests um, around. So I think this is a really simple drink that is nourishing that you can make for your family and for your friends. So I'm just trying to stir the zobo and then get out some cucumber and apple and orange that I can put in the cup before I try it out myself. Yes, so I cut it in half circles so that it'll be easy for me to put into my cup. And of course, I had to top it up a bit just to make sure the cup was well filled. So yeah, that's it. It's ready. I'm going to try it out now and I'll tell you the verdict. So drink, 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 drink some more, drink, drink, drink drink some more drink 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 some more mm. should i tell you it was good and what i like about this drink is that you can just easily add water and keep it for some minutes and you have infused water so simple so easy if you have a bottle at home you can even add the fruits into the bottle and the vegetable and just cover it and keep it in the fridge and have it later on so you can even double up as two drinks for your guests they have the zobo that has been infused and then while they're sitting talking they can add in water they have infused water very simple and something that is really beautiful to have on your table so i really enjoyed making this and i'm happy to be sharing it with you i hope you do give this a try if you give it a try definitely come back and let me know in the comment section thank you for watching remember to subscribe and turn on the notification bell share and like this video bye